So how many are, these are all yours? How many shoes is it total? Do you know? You don't know? Would you ever consider selling all of them? Everything. I don't know, you gotta get the calculator out. <laughs> What is up you guys? My name is Josh, also known as Harry Tornado. My wife Haley and I are full-time YouTubers and resellers. This means we film ourselves going to flea markets, thrift stores, garage sales, wherever we can buy stuff super cheap and then flip it online for a profit. If you're interested in content like this, be sure to go ahead and hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. Let's go ahead and jump into today's video. Struggling with what? My IKEA bag. Oh yeah, you gotta... I'll just, I'll just carry mine bundled up until we actually find something. Because the air resistance, if you leave it open, it's like a parachute slowing us down. Oh, Winnie the Pooh, Animal Kingdom. Oh, good, morning, Josh. good morning, how are you? Harry, Harry there you go. How are you doing? I'm fine, yourself. I'm doing very well. How much are your plushes? These. Um, well, I like the Winnie the Pooh and maybe this um, Mickey Mouse back here. That's a dollar, this one's two. Two? Okay, I'll give you three bucks for both of them. Well, let me see. I might, I might get something else. What's this one? Oh, that's Dis Disneyland. Who is he? Mm -hmm. How much is he? A dollar. Is he a dollar too? Okay, so we got this one. That's two dollars, three dollars, four, five. All right. You get a five? Well, we appreciate the deal. Thank you, ma'am. And um, here's mom. Okay. Oh, Zoe's mom. Right. Look at there. I was wondering how she shouldn't do me. <laughs> so this is where you get the hustle from. Yeah, we always, no, that's where I got it from. There, okay. Was he, was he always the entrepreneur growing up? Yes. Yes. I love it. I love it. Hey man, it, it's like I said, it's it's just uh, something in your blood, you know. You gotta. Some people are happy, some people Obviously, are. I've never sold my food in life. <laughs> I always eat mine, but I'll sell everything else. Oh, if it makes money, it's gone. I know it. That's right. <laughs> Love it. Oh, that's cool. There's always more to get. Absolutely, man. Yeah, you guys probably have a good day out here today. So. Yeah, man. We we missed you last weekend. Last weekend was really good. So hopefully it keeps going. Does it is it stay like busy in the winter too? That's usually the better time. Better time? Okay. Yeah, you come back. Yeah. Yeah. Once yeah. it cools off, then it gets real busy. Now yeah. then it's a drawback. When it gets too cold, yeah. it falls off again. Yeah, so you gotta yeah. fall is gonna be a good time then. Oh yeah. Excited. Thanks, man. How you doing, sir? Hanging in there. Hanging in there. That's all you can do. How much are your shoes? Every, everything's 10? Yes, sir. Yeah, these are. Look at proof. Those look cool. All right, so I'll get the blue pair and that white pair down there. 20 bucks? Yes, sir. All right. We got our own bag. Yeah, I appreciate it. Oh, oh, okay. Everybody out here is always on top of the bags, though. That's awesome. Thank you, bud. Yes, sir. Thank you. We appreciate it. Absolutely. Those are cool. How much are these? Uh, 15. 15? Yes. And what about these? Could you do 20 for both? That's why. That's okay? Okay. Alright. There you go. Thank you, sir. Appreciate it. Cool. I might just ask them for little cameras. Five bucks a piece. I'm assuming they need some work before they start working again could you do anything about them my yeah. sister used to collect them and yeah that's all we just use them to sit on the shelf could you do seven for both yeah i'll let them go for that 
Okay, I appreciate it. Thank you. Oop. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. There you go. Thanks, man. We appreciate it. Somebody just messaged me on Instagram or something, emailed me yesterday, mm -hmm. to, saying that they're looking for like old looking cameras just to collect, like hmm. decorate with. Now I just gotta remember who that was. I'm getting ready to make me one with the Buddha prayer beads. Oh, nice. Yeah, one. Goose brother. Said, no, it's gotta have a certain amount. Oh, yeah. How much is nice. the? Uh... How much is the, the bolt? Three bucks. I'll do three on that. Get three dollars. I got my own bag. Yeah. Yeah. Thank you, sir. Thank you, bro. One hundred eight. Somebody told me last week that's the same booth we got the King Kongs from. Yeah. And they said, oh my gosh, you missed a Murano glass ashtray at that booth. Go back and get it. And I don't know what that means, but that's the only thing that looks like an ashtray. So it looked pretty cool. Three bucks. Grab it. Maybe that's what they were talking about. Maybe not. But it had like nursery rhymes on it or something. It was like Little Bo Peep, uh, Little Miss Muffet, Three Blonde Mice. Mother, It's a Mother Goose hole. You every day oh, you tomorrow. do! Awesome. <laughs> Thank, Thank you. you so much. We got you, uh, your name is going to be Haley Hurricane. <laughs> Haley. <laughs> yes. I think it's like Harry, uh, Harry, Haley Tornado. Yeah. I just keep it. You keep have it. to keep it. I don't know. I, got you. I don't know because like I never thought that we get to a point where she would actually be able to join me. So when right. we came up with the name, I'm like. I don't know, like Rally Roots and Renzi, they just like combine their names, but like Josh and Haley don't really combine that yeah, well. I so like I, don't I don't know. know. We'll see. <laughs> we spent the last two years building the Harry Tornadoes. We'll keep it something similar. But, mm -hmm. but I appreciate you watching. Oh, Funny thing, good. You for yes, way too much stuff. Yeah, it's a, it's a lot of people out here today. It is. Mm -hmm. I guess it's going to be a nice day. We'll see. I think we'll so. see. Yeah. Good to meet you. Good luck. Get your hats. Oh, this is good. This is only three hundred fifty dollars. I could fit on it. You just got your Oculus. That's true. These hats are all like modern. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh wow, those are really cool. I've never seen Harley boots with that logo on the side. How much are your boots, ma'am? Oh, how much are the boots? 40? They look to be in pretty good shape. So that's 11, 11D, I think. That would be standard width. Look to be in good shape. Wow, look at the stingray thing. That was really cool. And it's even like white underbelly, like a real stingray. That thing would break yeah. <laughs> so easily though. Yeah. I'll look this up. Sorry, I'll get my bag out of here. Can't really see anything. Let's see if it's actually even in here. Yeah, that's new. Sir, what you got on this? Uh, 10. 10? Is that 50? That's really cool. Yeah, I, I would get it if I was scared. If we carried it around, the tail would break off. I got stung that one one time, man. It oh man, that's the most painful thing I ever had. Shout out Steve Irwin. It's unreal. It's pain. That isn't like an actual like thing that sticks in you. It's, it's like, like little barbs on the side of the tail. That little barbs stick out. Yeah. And like, pop, 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 is it venomous too, or is it just hurt? It, it, it's a it's a poison because the face like your arm it hit me right here. Yeah. My whole arm went numb. Man. And then just. Eight, like I was having a heart attack. Wow. I thought you had a heart attack. It hurts off your chest. Oh, 
That's crazy. But, yeah, but it's just just time. You just gotta let it pay. Cause yeah. Dying, but you, it's just time. That's crazy. Yeah, with a doctor, it's like, yeah, it's, it's you're fine. But yeah, you think you're dying because it's ungodly pain. Yeah. Mm. All right, I'm gonna see if he'll do 40 for this and the boots. All right, what do you think about 40 for the boots and the boat? Mm. That's five dollars off each one. I appreciate the deal, man. Yeah, yeah. How often do you guys come out here? Weather permitted. Weather permitted. There you yeah. go. Hopefully, it's going to cool down pretty soon, and you guys can. Oh yeah. yeah. So much to look at today. Hey, what's up, man? Good to see you. I don't know what that is. Oh, look at these Nike golf shoes. Those are super cool. Yeah. Let's see. Whose are they? Everybody walks away. Is this your table, ma'am? No, I don't know which way. Huh. We'll walk around. Tell her we want these Nike golf shoes over here. Okay. Thank you, ma'am crazy like this is like the peak time to shop mm -hmm. and so many people just walk away from their entire booth just to go well go to the bathroom before you get out here <laughs> like it's common business sense it's like oh like if you had a retail store that opened at 9 a.m you wouldn't shut down the store at 9 30 to yeah. go poop you know <laughs> how much are the shoes 10 i don't know Maybe they're like too dirty or something. I think these would be good. New Balance Fresh Run. They're like. Okay, I see a lady over there. There you do? Okay. I'll give you 10 on these. Okay, but thanks, sir. All right. I got it right here. Oh, okay. Thanks. All right, let's go see. How much do you think she's going to ask for the golf clubs? I mean, for the golf, for the golf shoes. 20? They'd probably sell for like. I don't know, Nike, they're like really cool. They're the Lunar Lawn, which is a good model, and they look like dress shoes. So I think we could probably get like 60 free shipping. Maybe. Is she back yet? No. Man. All right. You don't know how much her shoes were, do you? No, I don't know. There she go. Oh, is that you? Oh, hello. How much are these? 20. 20? Let's see what size they are. 11 and a half, that's a good size. I'll do, I'll do 20 for those, that's good. They're clean, hey, ready, yeah, <laughs> you got it right. We got a bag. We really do need to get shirts that say we have our own bag. <laughs> Thank you, ma'am. Cheetah five. How much are these? 10? Do you have a 10? Okay. I picked up a pair of these in Utah. And it's G Defy. But it's funny because this is the new logo. The old logo was a sperm. Like literally I saw a pair of Google. I was like, that's definitely a sperm on there. And it's like the, the owner of the company wanted to, I don't know, associate the shoes with like new life or something. We, we got it back. Thank you. And everybody's like, I guess I just went with it. And then they're like, wow, our sales are really terrible because apparently people don't want shoes with sperms on them. So they switched to this logo. These are good. Really, really clean. How much are these? 10? I don't know if they're worth 10. I saw, um, I saw somebody find a Ninja Turtle action figure. There was like a mutant version something. And it sold for like a hundred bucks, but I don't know what made it worth that much. Hello. All right, see any Hocus? Oh, Salomon. Those are nice. How much are these? 35. 35? SB check. These are all just so 
So clean. So how many are, these are all yours? How many shoes is it total? Do you know? You don't know? Would you ever consider selling all of them? Everything. Because I know, I've seen your Goodwill. I know you're going and you're buying stuff and you're cleaning it. Because we, we sell shoes online. So we come here and buy, you know, two or three pairs. But I'm like, we should just see if she would take a price for all of them. Save, I don't know. You got to get the calculator out. <laughs> I didn't think you would. I just figured I'd ask. You know, if you if you ever know. interested, huh? You have all those back there. Oh, they're all filled in the van. Wow. We're I, I'm willing. If you ever want to sell like a bunch at once, just let me know. We'll uh -huh, okay. we'll we'll buy them. Uh -huh. Obviously, we need to get a good deal, you know. But it <laughs> saves you time. You don't have to bring them out here and sell them one at a time, you know. These red ones are cool. Yeah. Ten and a half. How much are these? Twenty-five. That's not bad. Oh, yeah, I'll just pay up. Creating good relationships. All right, we're gonna get the blue ones and those red ones. Thirty-five and twenty-five, sixty, right? Okay. Thank you. If you ever want to sell everything, let me know. <laughs> Some Ariots. They're really small though, but they're brand new. Hmm. Like yeah. How much are these? 35? It's not bad. If they were a little bit bigger, that would be good. Those are so small that they'd be tough to sell. Those are interesting. Yeah. Have you heard of that before? Limbs? I've never heard of that. Boulder, Colorado? If it's in Boulder, Colorado, it might be good. Let's look it up. Yeah. How much are those? Twenty-five. Twenty-five? I'll do I'll do twenty-five for this. Do you have five ones, please, ma'am? Mm -hmm. I only have a ten in this pocket. There you go. Thank you. We got a bag. Thank do you have you any know. um do you have any hokas? H O K A. Six pair this morning, they all sold. Yeah. Yeah, they're good. Would you ever consider selling everything? How, how, how much for everything? Everything. You don't know? Ask your husband? Okay. We, we buy shoes to sell online. So we're trying to find somebody that's willing to sell us like a big lot of shoes like that. So this, we're here every weekend. So if you ever see us and you want to sell everything, yeah, let me know. <laughs> Oh, you oh, watched the channel. Thank you. thank you so much. I appreciate that. Yeah. Oh, the Danners. They were. How much are these? Forty-five. Forty-five. Yeah. Could you do forty? Forty. Okay. Thank you. There you go. Appreciate it. Have a good day. I bet everybody out here watches me, and they're just like, "Oh, there's that freaking guy again." Is this a typewriter? Nope. What That's is it? I got three more. I have a three Oh, a clarinet. I used to play clarinet. You did? Yep. Sixth grade. I got picked on, so I stopped. I started because I wanted to be like Squidward from SpongeBob, and then I didn't think that people would pick on me because clarinet is apparently a feminine instrument. No, that's not true. It's not true. But hindsight, you know, 2020. All right. Thank you. We appreciate it. We will. Good to see you. Good to see you. Five dollar socks. Five dollar socks. That's a pretty good deal. How much is this? I'll go three. Three bucks? I'll give you three bucks on that. Haley, can I have three dollars, please? I appreciate that. Bunko. Thanks, man. Doing. These are adult socks, right? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. I'll do. I'll do two. All right. Thank you so much. I didn't turn the GoPro on, but we just bought some vintage dumbbells. Uh, <laughs> they're, not that, they're not that. <laughs> they're they're five pounds each, um, which dumbbells aren't really worth much individually. But these are York branded, which are like vintage dumbbells. Um, 
like a couple months ago we found some 20 pound a set of 20 pound of these just like these but instead of five is 20. i think we sold those for like 130 bucks or so yeah, really? so we paid five dollars for the pair of these Haley agreed to carry them if we if we bought them uh and i haven't looked up comps but i imagine we could probably get like 40 to 50 bucks for the pair those are cool how much are these 30. 30. it's not bad my bubble's good they're clean I'm gonna take a chance on these. Yeah. Thank you so much. Appreciate it. Okay. So that was our flea market haul from this past weekend. We ended up spending a total of $298 on everything all together. And I think conservatively after fees, shipping and cost of goods, once we get all this stuff cleaned and photographed and listed and most importantly sold, we should see a profit on this haul of between $450 and $500. I think that's a pretty fair assessment. A couple of the things that we bought, I wasn't looking up sold comps as we were shopping. I probably should have, but like the Danner boots that we got near the end of the, the day there, we paid 40 bucks for those. There's only one sold comp on those for like $50 free shipping, but there are two currently listed in used condition between 80 and 90 bucks. So we may list ours for 80 bucks or so plus shipping. They're in excellent condition. Hopefully we'll be able to make a little bit of money on those, but everything else turned out pretty well. I mean, I was really happy with today's haul. Unfortunately, we couldn't get either of those ladies to give us a, a price or even like a a good answer if they would be even interested in selling all of their shoes to us at once. But we're going to keep building those relationships, paying up for their shoes, you know, being nice, being friendly with them, because I can see that relationship in the future being very profitable for both of us. I've seen both of those ladies at the Goodwill Bins and regular thrift stores buying really dirty shoes, working their magic behind the scenes to get them super clean and then bring them to the flea market to sell them uh, at some pretty competitive prices. So if I can basically hire them to source and clean shoes for us and then we buy all the shoes they have at wholesale it would be a lot of shoes we may have to get a warehouse or something or figure out a better storage solution for our garage but i think that relationship could work uh i may, I may have to work on it a little bit more they neither of them seemed really excited about the idea today but maybe if i go there with a big wad of cash next time they'd be more interested in hearing me out but uh if you guys have enjoyed today's video at all all we ask is that you take a couple seconds and hit that like button for us down below and if you haven't already go ahead and hit that subscribe button down below as well thank you guys again for watching you're the best and we'll catch you on the next one Whew.